The health ministry has been anticipating a spike in COVID-19 infections post-carnival. Over the last few weeks, the island has been recording a noticeable rise in COVID-19 cases as mass crowd activities continue apace. Health Minister Moses Jabatis, speaking to journalists this week, stated that medical officials warn God for the increase in infections given the very contagious nature of COVID-19, especially the Omicron variants. We continue to see um, over the last uh, few days, you notice that the numbers have been going up. We expected that because we have an increase in um, social activities. Um, we see mass activities both prior to carnival and then you had carnival and then our emancipation activities. But even way before that, um, we notice um, our people continue to gather in mass crowd events and so on. And um, we know that because of the way COVID is spread, we, we, we expected that. Nonetheless, the health minister indicated that medical officials were ready to manage the event of a spike in cases. We believe that we can handle this situation. We know that most of the individuals are not um, very ill and we do not have a large number of hospitalizations. So we are, very, we, we, we are hoping that our people can continue to do the best that they can. Meanwhile, there is a new threat looming, the monkeypox virus. The health ministry is beefing up measures to manage potential cases. Um, we are monitoring monkeypox, as you know. And uh, we, we, anytime we have a suspected case, we, we let the public know and you know, we take samples and send, and send to CAFA. This week, the Biden administration in the U.S., St. Lucia's number one tourism source market, declared the monkeypox outbreak a national health emergency. Gina Filippi, HDS News Force.